Remember that? No, 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 no. Remember Steve Blackman? Oh, I remember. Oh, I love Steve Blackman. Mm, yeah, I remember that. Wait. Remember? Wait, what? Yeah, yeah. Oh, I remember. Ooh, remember. What the f is going on with these member berries? Jesus! Welcome to the weekend here at Muscle in the Morning, brought to you by Iron Mag Labs. Make your mark. I'm Dave Palumbo, and today is Friday, October 21st, 2016. And let's find out what's going on in the world of bodybuilding and fitness. I've heard of guys having growth spurts a little later in life before, but what we've been seeing from Aaron Clark as of late is starting to border on ridiculous. Earlier this week, the former 212 Pro released some stunning new progress photos showing the world what it looks to be every bit of a lean 250 plus pounds of pure nastiness. Before he decided to make the jump to the open bodybuilding class, Clark was already known as a cold-blooded assassin in the 212 division. But after a year plus of solid training and growing, he's already got into uncharted territory. If he can keep up the scorching pace and continue to pack on size, by the time this season rolls around next year, he'll be a force to be reckoned with. After closing out a spectacular sophomore season that included three straight top six finishes, including a top five at the Arnold Classic to kick off the season, 212 monster in training, Kyung Won Kang seems to be firing on all cylinders. New training footage shows the former Arnold Amateur overall winner putting himself through the paces during a recent shoulder training session as he attempts to add some more depth to a physique that already has cartoonish looking 3D muscle. Last year, Kang really exploded onto the scene out of nowhere when he won his pro debut at the Dallas Europa Pro before going on to deliver a brilliant encore by the way of an 11th place Olympia finish. From front to back, Kang's physique really doesn't have any glaring weaknesses. So if he can keep adding muscle and bringing that grade A conditioning, it won't be long before we see him return to the winner's circle. It looks like all systems are a go for 212 standout Ahmad Ahmad. After announcing that he'd be bringing his season to a close following his sixth place finish at the Toronto Pro, the former Olympian has been hard at work focusing on getting back to the basics through the early phases of his off-season. This week, Ahmad released some new progress photos showing off a bigger, rejuvenated-looking physique to go along with what seems to be some pretty solid conditioning at the moment. Expectations were high for Ahmad coming into this season off his first career Top 10 Olympia finish back in 2015. But as the season wore on, you could start to see the grind taking its toll. Now that he's taking some time off to focus on getting back to doing what he does best, by this time next season, he'll be ready to snap back into championship level form. If you're one of those bodybuilding super fans that's been keeping your eye out for the next Middle East monster that's going to come along and take the world by storm, may I present to you Hassan Mustafa. The 24-year-old former world amateur heavyweight champ has been on a warpath as of late and announced earlier this week that he has eyes set on taking the stage sometime next March. Which seems like a not so subtle hint that he's planning to make his way out to the Arnold stateside in Columbus, Ohio. Even at 24 years old, Mustafa has some of the craziest 3D muscle that you're ever going to see. And when he's in shape, this kid has already proven that his talent is on par with some of the best on the planet. Now that he's got his focus dialed in with a real tangible target to shoot for, we're probably going to see him take things to an entirely new level over the course of these next few months. It's been a while since we've heard anything from Darren Glenn. The man better known as Hollywood has been keeping his head under the radar a bit since his last competition at the Charlotte Pro earlier in the season. 
but this week Len dropped some new progress photos to let his fans know what he's been up to as of late. From what we can see, Hollywood has really been putting in some serious work and seems to be sporting the best level of off-season conditioning of his entire career. Over the last few years, we've seen Glenn start to come into his own as a bodybuilder, filling out his frame and bringing a steadily improving level of conditioning to the stage. Despite only competing once this year, those signs of improvement were evident from the moment he walked out on stage. And if he can keep focused on the task at hand, just as he's already done so far, it feels like this offseason could end up being his most productive yet. And that does it for yet another edition of Muscle in the Morning, brought to you by Iron Mag Labs. Make your mark. Check out IronMagLabs.com today. I'm Dave Palumbo, reminding you to always be true to your passions, and make sure to follow us on Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram.